Today, I respectfully ask that we adjourn in the memory of Noni Olabisi, who passed away on March 1, 2022. She was 67 years old. Noni Olabisi was born in St. Louis, Missouri in 1954, but left shortly after her mother died when she was four. Her father took Olabisi, her sister and brother, to Arkansas, where they lived for five years before relocating to Los Angeles, along with a woman Olabisi's father had married, who had five children of her own. Noni was a self-taught Los Angeles artist and muralist. Noni's artwork focused on themes rooted in black history and social issues. Uh, her murals depict the endurance of spirit maintained by blacks born in America and speaks to the need to continue the perseverance for justice and equality. Among Noni's many large-scale murals is Freedom Won't Wait in the 30th District, which shows a number of black figures crying out or wincing in pain. Noni made it in 1992 on the side of a South Central barber shop where she sometimes cut hair. After the community uprising that followed, the acquittal of police officers videotaping, videotaped beating Rodney King. Noni's work spans over 30 years, and she has received many awards in recognition for her artwork. Noni was awarded the coveted California Community Foundation Visual Artist Fellowship, Documenter of Los Angeles' Black Pride. She brought to her practice a deeply spiritual approach through which she manifests her incredible designs. Noni is also known for some of her other murals, To Protect and Serve, Resurrection, it takes a village to raise a child and trumpet for the people. And many of these are in the 30th. And if you are ever in the district, I really encourage you to drive around. Um, and you will just be surprised when you turn a corner off of Jefferson and 11th, for example, and see one of her artworks, one of her murals. As an artist, Noni said, the intention is to create artwork that speaks to the heart and soul of mankind, invoking self-examination. I believe my art provides a journey that leads us all to the discovery of the one thing we all have in common, light. The light unites us all to the realization that we are all related. You know, I had the pleasure of meeting Noni Olabisi when I worked for, at Spark under Judy Baca, the Social and Public Art Resource Center, and I was responsible for a restoration project in each of the city council districts across the city and we um, renovated, resurrected a couple of, um, of hers and had her involved in it. And she worked with uh, another artist, Alma Lopez, and they did much of their artwork together in collaboration in South LA. And Noni was this amazing bright light of um, inspiration, of resilience, of fortitude. She was so even, and she really, exemplified what it means to love humanity. Noni Olabisi is survived by her son, Aronde Spears, and her grandson, Jabari Spears. She was a teacher, a mentor, and her contributions to the legacy of mural art cannot be measured. There will be a public memorial scheduled for April, and I ask that we respectfully adjourn in her memory. Thank you.